Hey guys, I'm Carrie from Counselor Carrie, and today I'm going to show you how to assemble your Calm Corner Feelings Check In and Calming Strategy Choice Boards inside a file folder. So, here I have the folder open to the inside and folded in half, and I just glue my Feelings Check In board right here on top. Now I'm going to add Velcro dots to each of the squares. And this is just one half of the Velcro dot. Once you have all of your dots on there, I go ahead and add the top half of the Velcro dot before I put the cards on. This way you don't really have to worry about matching up the dots perfectly if you put it on your card first. So I just put the dot right on top of the other dot and put the cards on top and press down to make sure that it adheres really nicely. Once you get all of your cards on there, just give them a nice press to make sure that they stick. And then you're going to flip over your folder to put your calming strategy choice board on the other side of the inside of the folder. Just glue it right here and press it down to make sure it sticks really well. Then you're gonna do the same thing that you did on the other side and add your Velcro dots inside the square. Once you get all those dots in there, you can go ahead and put the other half of the dot right on top. And then you can add your calming strategy tiles right on top. So these are things that you have in your calming corner for your students to use when they go there when they need some time to regulate. All right, once you get them all on there, give them a good press, make sure that they're nice and stuck, and then you can close your folder and it's set to go. When your students visit your common corner, they can choose the feeling that they're experiencing, and then they can take the strategies that they're gonna use and Velcro them right there in your file folder. These also work great for individuals. Maybe you don't have a common corner in your office, that's just fine, you can make one of these for a particular student and use strategies that are meaningful for that student and they can keep them in a binder or in their desk. Thanks for checking in with me today. Be sure to click the subscribe button to get counseling ideas to spark student growth delivered right to your inbox.